Hello everyone. Today we are going to see nano electro mechanical system lens in fabrication system. Let's go to the video. I am M Subhashmi. My roll number is 21 PHY 512. My subject is nanophysics. My subject in charge is Mrs. V. Bhuneshwari. We are living in the nano electronic world. Now we are going to nano electronic world. Yes, I am going to talk about nano electro mechanical system NEMS in fabrication system. We all know about nano electro mechanical devices. For example, chips, computer motherboard. In nano electro mechanical devices, the fabrication method can be used. So, it is called nano electro mechanical system. Nano motors can be used in biological aspects. For example, flagella motor. It is used to find bacteria. Flagella are long, thin, blade like structure like goosebumps whip like structure of nano motor consisting of a highly structured conchloromate of protein molecules and chloride in the membrane of the bacteria a motor has a shaft and the structure about the shaft resembling an armchair motor is not driven by electromagnetic force but the breakdown of adenosine triphosphate energy rich molecules, it can be change the shape of the molecules. Semiconductor industry, the optical lithography is an important manufacturing tool. To fabricate semiconductor devices smaller than 100 nanometers, the ultraviolet light of shorter wavelengths 193 nanometer is required. Electron beam and the X-ray lithography can be used to make nanostructure, but this process is not suitable for the large scale manufacturing. Electron beam lithography uses a finely focused beam of electrons, which is scanned in a specific pattern of surface level material. Surface having 10 nanometer resolution. It's the beam to hit the surface point by point in serial. X-ray lithography can produce pattern on surface having 20 nanometer resolution. But its mask technology and the exposure system are complex and expensive for practical applications. A technique called nano imprint lithography has been developed that may provide a low cost, high production on rate manufacturing technology. What is nano imprinting technology? It transfer pattern of nanoscale features from a mold to a target substrate. Nano imprinting classified into two types. First one thermal pre-imprinting, second one ultraviolet. First we are going to see thermal imprinting only. In thermal imprinting, we consider a mold. A mold is typically silicon substrate or nickel sim. The orange color represents resid or thermoplastic. The blue color represents substrate. The mold can be pressured by using of heat. The temperature above glass transition temperature. The mold pattern can be removed in the resist or thermoplastic after the pattern is transferred to the substrate. Scanning tunneling microscope is used to observe the properties and behavior of subatomic particles to further improve this technology. I am going to show the one practical video for the quantum quarrel. I am going to take three vessels with the filling of waters. I am inserting my finger one by one. The waveform is coming out. So it is looks like a quantum quarrel. The quantum quarrel is nothing but a circular array of ions atoms on here copper surface called a 
quantum quarrel. I am going to ask six questions from my video. I am giving five seconds for you for each questions and a test of your knowledge. The first question: What is the expansion of N M E S? Your time starts now. One, two, three, four, five. The second question: Does motors can be used in the biological aspects? Your time starts now. One. Two, three, four, five. The third question: What is the expansion of ATP? Your time starts now. One, two, three, four, five. The fourth question: A more recently using technique is called dash. Your time starts now. One, two, three, four, five. The fifth question: The electron jump in the tip. This effort is called dash. Your time starts now. One, two, three, four, five. Last but not least, the sixth question is: A circular array of iron atoms on a copper surface is called dash. Your time starts now. One, two, three, four, five. I thank Mrs. V. Bhuvanesh Mary Ma'am uh, because she is giving wonderful opportunity for me, and this video is fully edited by my two wonderful bodyguards, uh, Veera Rahul and Veera Rahavan. Uh, thank you, guys.